Good Morning Britain coming up on the show. My religion is the religion of justice. This is Gavin Long. He's a former U.S. Marine and he's been named as the man who shot dead three police officers in Louisiana, wounding three others. President Obama has called on the nation to remain united in the wake of the killings. A minute's silence will be held across France today to remember the 84 people who were killed in the terror attack in Nice on Friday. 18 people remain in hospital in critical condition, a number of those children. Yes, yeah, still thousands of people coming along to the promenade to leave flowers and light candles as well. And amidst the shock and the sadness here, a story of hope. A seven-year-old boy, himself badly injured in the attack and thought to have been orphaned, will now be reunited with his mother. Meanwhile, the 50,000 Britons currently on holiday in Turkey have been warned to take extra care as the government cracks down on those thought to be behind Friday's failed coup. Also this morning, we'll be joined by Greg Wallace after outrage at last week's celebrity MasterChef eviction. We'll give the judge a good grilling. Monday, 18th of July, 2016, live from ITV Studios in London. This is Good Morning Britain. At uh, 8 o'clock on main news this morning, Barack Obama has appealed for all Americans to unite and remain calm after three police officers were shot dead in Baton Rouge, the city where a black man was controversially killed by police two weeks ago. The gunman, named as former U.S. Marine Gavin Long, shot six officers in an apparent ambush before being killed himself. Detectives are investigating a string of videos he allegedly posted online urging people to fight back in the name of justice. Well, Ross King is in Los Angeles. Ross, last week five policemen killed in America. This week three more with three critically injured. People are calling this civil war now between parts of the black community and the law enforcement officers in America. Is it as bad as this? 